Yo, it's Skiddo. I'm here today talking about Brellas. A shotgun-esque weapon with a built-in shield. It's a one of a kind. But which is the best Brella out of the four? So let me rip off that band-aid and tell you that the what is it called? The Recycled Brella 24 MK1 is the best Brella. So let me tell you how to play it. The Recycled Brella is very versatile in its game plan, ranging from its offense to its defense. But let me start with the offense. So you want to talk about offense, but we can't talk about offense without the numbers. Yep, I'm about to have Sheldon kicking his legs. Each shot takes 8 frames to come out, and there's a 35 frame delay within consecutive shots. So basically, it fires fast. Each pellet does 15 points of damage, with 6 total pellets coming in one shot. Which also means its maximum damage is 90 points. Plenty enough to kill a lightly tapped opponent. Yo, pause real quick. Mr. Nagami, do you think we should buff the Brella, you know, make the people happy? No! But it's what we want! No! Take this! Okay. I'll talk about the Brella itself in a few minutes, but since it's the fastest traveling Brella, that allows you to have some of the best mobility in the game, which is great for pushing any objective. Hey guys, self-promo Skiddo here. If you guys are messing with the video, pretty please subscribe. Your boy's trying to get to partner. As a Brella with a Brella, you would think it shines on defense. No, not really. The Recycle Brella's setback is that the Brella is weak, so relying on the Brella for defense is not that smart. But I'll tell you what you can do. Remember this bad boy? That's your escape tool. Throwing one at the ground provides an instant escape option, or just hit your shots. As for the Brella itself, yes it is weak, but here's some tips. It can still protect you from a splashdown. As well as that, since the Brella deploys so fast, it can very easily protect you coming down from a super jump compared to the other Brellas. Now on paper, this kit might not be doing too much, but that's on paper. Angle Shooter serves as a perfect combo tool, and the Recycle Brella already has great range, so use the Angle Shooter to finish them. Skiddo, side note. Don't be no. afraid to miss with the Angle Shooter. It's a very cheap sub, so there's no real downside to throwing them out there. The worst you could do is locate them. Now, I'm gonna shed some light on the big bubs. Put it on checkpoints and corners when you're on tower control, so that the tower can linger inside the bubble. That could also go for Rainmaker, too. But don't put it on the tower itself. That'll decrease its duration. That's it for the video. Yes, it was short, but I'm trying to keep it sweet, you know? If y'all got something out of the video and liked it, then drop your boy a like or a sub. But seriously, thank you guys for getting me to 1K. It's not possible without you guys. For now, I'm out, but I love y'all.